Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Tuple Player Negative AE, and today we are back, uh, but uh, with uh, Dog and Ropa to Goodbye Despair. But without losing a heart, we all went back to the hotel. Believe in your friends, huh? Um, we've kind of established who's angry, who's flustered, the leader. It'd be hard to difficult uh, to believe them right away, but it would be nice if it could happen a little at a time. I'm starting to think that I'm. If I'm starting to think like that, doesn't it, doesn't that show that I'm making good progress? I cannot speak, dude. Uh, yeah, it does, but you're showing progress at the wrong time. Then there's no reason to hole up in my room and stare blankly into space. Since this time, it would be a great idea if I went ahead and talked to everyone. I know it's sudden, but it's time for a brief tutorial. Hello. Uh, during the school trip, there will be moments called free time. During free time, you'll be able to strengthen your friendship uh, by spending time with other students. Uh, also, if you give them a present afterwards, they might even make a you might even make a better impression. Uh, you can obtain gifts from the Mano Mano uh, Yashin, Yashin, uh, the vending machine at the supermarket. When you strengthen a friendship, an intimate event is activated and added to the report card. Uh, if you show any hope fragments you've gathered to Usami via the report card, you can gain new skills. Feel free to strengthen your friendships with as many people as you want. Also, if you spend time with someone, time will pass. Ooh. And you will return to your cottage afterward. After passing time several times, your free time will end and you will continue on to the main story. By the way, you can skip free time by resting in your cottage bed. Although I don't really recommend it, please use it if you just uh, please use it if you just want to continue the main story right away. All right, free time. Uh, so this is this episode is just going to be straight free time the entire time. So we're looking for uh, Monokuma dolls. I don't think he's, there's going to be any more. Okay, he's just going to say the same thing like an idiot. Alright, let's leave. Okay, so this is free time. Do I have any mail? Did I check my mailbox? No? Okay, I guess there's no mail. Alright, so you're there. There's the nurse. I like the nurse. I really like the nurse. Let's talk to you. What do you have to say? That's weird. Wow, a stranger is talking to me. I don't know anyone who would try to who would try to talk to me so casually. What should I do? Should I hang out with Kyo uh, Hyokyo when she's acting like this? Let's see who else is around. I should. I should hang out with him. What are you? This, this is too weird. It's too weird for me. If I'm alone, I'll go crazy. Yeah. Um... Let's hang out. Is, is it okay for you to hang out with... Yeah, I mean, you're a little... Thank you very much. Aw. Listen. We'll be the best of friends. I spent time sitting next to Mikan who was moved. Uh, she seemed at a loss for words. Uh, it seems like Mikan... Would you like to... Definitely. What would you like to give her? I don't have any presents. Are you sure? Hold on to it. Despite the fact that we decided to hang out, Mina is actually, and hasn't tried to look at me at all. Somehow, I feel like I did something bad to her, even though I didn't do anything. Huh? I'm sorry. What is this all of a sudden? I thought... You clearly looked like you were in a bad mood. Did I do something wrong again? What should I do? Um, would it make you happier if I took my clothes off? Whoa! Mikan! You need to just calm yourself. What? Why are you re Yeah, exactly. Who says that? Who goes... Who goes up to people like, Oh, I'm sorry I made you mad. Would you be happy if I took my clothes off? <laughs> Makes no sense. You're right. You don't want to see me naked, right? Then how about my money? Seriously, hold on. Well, I agree, I'm sorry. It's no use. I feel like if I start panicking, the situation's only gonna get worse. Alright, I should just calm down first. Hey, Mikan, I wanted to talk to you normally. Talk? 
today is such a beautiful day. I agree. Yeah. Dots, I'm so sorry. Should I take me can? What? Seriously, you don't have to like what? Type of pizza, type of guy. Uh, favorite bandage type. She's the she's the medic. What type of bandage do you like the most? Bandage? Let's see, there are a lot of tip, uh, different types these days. It's extremely convenient because there are waterproof types and sticky types. But I definitely like non-elastic types the best. They're definitely not too constricting, but they firmly secure wounds. I'm glad. Uh, it looks like she's getting into the conversation. I'm sorry, I went ahead and started talking on my own. But don't worry about it, I'm the one who asked anyway. Also, I feel like I got to know you a little more. Really? Yes. Let's call it a day for now. Um, if it's not too much trouble, I would like to talk to you again. It's been a while since anyone talked to me like this, so... Of course. Anytime. Thank you very much. <laughs> we decided to go our separate ways for now. But for some reason, I feel like Mikan was staring at my back for a little too long. She's not a bad person, but I don't really know how to communicate with her that well. Hey! For now, I decided to return to my room. Is it nighttime? No, it's still daytime. Still got some time left. I don't feel like doing it, uh, doing nothing, so maybe I should go somewhere. Free time. Yes. Is Mikan still in the same place? I'll talk to her again. What's his name? Wants to go. I don't want to talk to Biakia. Biakia is like the person I least want to talk to. Um, let's uh, let's check the map. Ooh, it's F1, isn't it? Yep. There's the map. There's gamer gamer girls inside the lobby. We got what's his name inside the restaurant. Um. Ibu uh, Ibuku is in there, Peko's there. I think it would be beneficial for us to talk to Peko? Because she's a swordsman? I don't know if it really matters. Let's go let's go and talk to the gamer girl. Since we are we are video gamer anyway. I feel like I should like make friends with gamer girl. Chikaki Minu. I'm starting to get sleepy. What should I do? Yeah, I mean, you can't just fall asleep. Hey, hey. Let's go somewhere with good airflow. It'd probably be good, uh, it'd probably feel good to sleep then. We went to the park, and I spent time making small talk with Cheetahs before she does that. Looks like she I gotta be uh, closer, would you? Not really. I'm staring out the space, uh... Docs. Sorry. Oh, sorry. I was getting a little sleep. While you were standing? Impressive. Have you not been sleeping well? Mm -hmm. Um, when I'm gaming, I tend to forget about sleeping. Sometimes I even forget to breathe. That's not good. <laughs> Plus, I keep having nightmares. I have a bad dream the other day, so I'm a little scared. Can I ask what kind of dream you had? What was the dream about the trio punch? Or trio the punch? What? Um. The, ja the statue at Jabberwock Island changed into a bald old man with a thin mustache. Uh, it's probably that game that t also takes place on the tropical island. The more I think about it, the more the situation feels like a bizarre action game. We might eventually end up turning into sheep. Tree of the Punch is a game, right? What kind of game is it? More importantly, you must really enjoy games, huh, Chikaki? Mm. Uh, how do I put it? I like it, but gaming is my life. Or maybe life is just a game? But still... Either way, there's still, uh, all the more reason why killings shouldn't be allowed. It's not a game if you're not having fun. It doesn't mean anything if you focus on winning or losing. You're right. Uh, it doesn't mean games always have to have a happy endings, but you should get something out of beating them. There might be weird games out here and there, but there are ways of enjoying those too. That's why bizarre games are fun. You can beat them as long as you do your very best. As expected of the ultimate gamer, you should probably just give up on a game like that. 
But to tell you the truth, there's one type of game I'm not really good at. What is that? Visual novels? Oh! <gasps> you have a cat hoodie! Oh, wow, that's so cute. I won't tell you. Let's see. Does she have a reason for not telling me? Oh, just by talking to Chikaki, I feel like I was able to understand her, so I guess that's good enough for that. Yo, look at that hope fragment, though. I parted ways with Chikaki and went back to my room. What time of day is it? It's nighttime. Ding dong, dong ding. Is that a bell just now? Could it be? Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. What's your announcement? Hello, everyone. The fun time you've all been waiting for is about to begin. Fuck! Did someone die? I wonder what festivities await you. Oops. Don't want to ruin the surprise. It was a little meh at first, but anyway, please gather at Jabberwock Park. Are you going to tell us about the bomb? Like, and that's going to be our motive to kill? In the middle of the night, what's he up to? Suddenly I had a bad feeling about all of this and goosebumps sprang up all over my body. If we're not allowed to defy Monokuma, then there's no way I can ignore this, right? Which means there's nothing I can do except listen to him. Damn it. What is it now? Um, that's a good question. And at that, we're going to end the episode. This was free time. Um, we're going to see what happens in the next episode. Um, hopefully we get to know more about this bomb. I like the free roam. I like this. It's cool. I, like, I can move around and stuff. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are having a good rest of your day. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Uh, peace out, guys.